Hello guys, how is it going? Today I'm here to give you the details of the spook event. So first off, as you can see in the background, we have a cool decorated spawn. I'm going to go ahead and go over the details. You guys will be getting a 25% TP booster, so that's pretty cool. You guys will be getting a 25% store sale off pretty much all the items. There's a few exceptions, like the season pass notably. As well as some cool texture changes such as the a new mod pack menu with a rotating background. A new hot bar, a new stat sheet menu, a new inventory, new crossbar, cross crossbar, crosshair. Cross those bars, my boy. Uh, new setting backdrop. That doesn't matter. New button textures, new health bar textures, and popo with a goofy little pumpkin head. Along with that, you guys will be getting some unique cosmetics that are brand new. Never used these kind of cosmetics before. You guys will be getting two masks, being the pumpkin mask and the skeleton mask so that's very nice rook did a great job on those those will be uh gained through the event through trading in spook essence cool he lied they're not both gained through the trader one of them is gained through the trader and the other one is gained through the roll system which you guys will hear about soon as well as a new spook 2022 title through spook essence via the trader of course and finally a brand new particle which can be applied to any form you want you turn it on via the cosmetic toggle menu and it's on any form you want as well as a, another cosmetic the skeleton t-shirt which just like the modern t-shirt which pretty much no one has this is actually the first t-shirt you guys can actually every player can get so with that in mind yeah go get it Another cosmetic. That's a lot of cosmetics for this update. Update? I meant event. We also have another t-shirt that was not made two hours before the event's going to come out. It's a candy corn t-shirt. It's very nice. Hey, how's it going? I'm here to explain to you guys how the spook jack-o-pot works. Yeah, spooky jack-o-pot, if you will. The actual name. So please, if you will. I like that. Anyway, uh, you use currency for this thing. As you can see, the rewards are on screen. So if I was to put 500 in this roll, right? Event, roll, spook, 500 is the command. As you can see on screen, cool. Uh, you would get anything up to 500 points. And if you get something that's 400 points in that roll, I don't know if there's there. I'm not looking at the list like you guys are. I can't, I got no info here. So if you get 400, you only have 100 points left. And basically, if whatever you put in, it will roll until you have zero remaining. So, uh, it's kind of like a crate in the way that it chooses an item randomly, except you decide the range based on how much currency you put in. How do you get the currency, you might ask? Challengers. Every challenger, uh, here are the level ranges, they drop a specific tier of candy at a specific rate right here. And that rate will change if you're in the mid-range. So, if I'm in tier one, mid-range one, I'll get these drop rates, which are higher than the normal drop rates by a little bit to signify the stronger challenger, right? So, with that in mind, Spook Challengers, they're back this year, great. They also have the highest rates of currency drop. Uh, to explain the currency, tier one, two, three, four, and five, are those are the tiers. Tier one is two, tier two is four, and then it's six, eight, 10, so on, right? For tier three, four, and five. So. With that in mind, which uh, which tier are you going to be farming? That's totally up to you guys, of course. Uh, all of it counts to the same currency. At the end of the event, we'll have a leaderboard. We'll calculate it, and we'll give you guys, like, the top whatever, right? Maybe it will be in-game. Maybe it won't. Depends. That's a lot of coding on my side to calculate that. How will that blah, 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 whatever. So, with that in mind, yeah there will be rewards for those who reach top ranks uh i don't have those, those rewards for you guys now but i'll have them sometime during the event if not after the event but either way the data is stored so you guys can talk to each other you can check your own event currency with this command slash event currency spook will give you it or you right click your cute little spook basket i forgot to mention a very important detail about the candy jackpot thing you have to get the basket for, at Warp Spook from Frogo Basket Dealer. Creative, I know. You gotta get the basket from him before you can get the currency. However, whenever you 
would get the currency roll wise like rate wise it would it will tell you hey you don't have the basket yet or whenever your character data loads it will say hey you don't have the basket yet so very unlikely that you'll not have the basket or you're missed cool just wanted to make it very obvious for everyone so you right click your basket you can see the currency cool you guys can compare and chat we won't the leaderboard won't be public during the event both for the sake of kind of anonymous competition there by the way currency it's account based so if you you can grind on whatever character slot whatever server you want it's all and everyone's going to be competing that'll be cool good luck there will be pretty good rewards for the top like ranks we'll probably give real rewards for like top one two three four and five so keep that in mind and things like top five percent and so on and so forth will also get rewards that's great um some final notes daily missions they give you one spook essence per mission so three a day small little touch uh, as well as the gift box you'll get days uh, this is replacing the old daily bonus system because that was laggy yeah and just terrible to configure so we have this system works just like gift box just do gift box claim event boom that's great yeah i hope you guys uh enjoy this event we've done a lot for this event we've gone pretty hard for this event so i hope you guys enjoy it peace out